Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How much is the capital gains tax now? And capital gains tax is levied on the profit from the sale of assets. These assets can include stocks, real estate, and other investments. The tax rate depends on the holding period of the asset. If you hold an asset for more than one year, it is considered a long-term capital gain. Long-term capital gains are generally taxed at a lower rate. If you hold an asset for one year or less, it is considered a short-term capital gain. Short-term capital gains are typically taxed at the same rate as ordinary income. The current long-term capital gains tax rates are 0%, 15%, or 20%. These rates depend on your taxable income and filing status. For low-income taxpayers, the rate may be 0%. For middle-income taxpayers, the rate is often 15%. High-income taxpayers may face a rate of 20%. NN short-term capital gains are taxed at your ordinary income tax rate. This rate can range from 10% to 37%, based on your income level. NN some states also impose their own capital gains taxes. These state taxes vary and can affect your overall tax liability. It is important to consider both federal and state taxes when planning your investments. On To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.